The uh, Path Ranger spends most of the year um, repairing and maintaining upland footpaths in the Lake District. So about nine months of the year is spent doing path work, about three months of the year is, is doing general estate work in the valleys. The path team comprises of four people. We kind of go on one and a half metres per person per day, so it's not fast. The hardest part, it's all fairly hard. It varies really, I mean, you know, from one job to another. Sometimes the hardest part can be actually just manhandling the stones into the ground. Other times the hardest part can be actually digging the ground. It's all done by hand, there's very little machinery other than the helicopter. Um, the rocks are put in the helicopter bags by hand, the rocks are taken out of the helicopter bags by hand, um, and the tools we have is, is basically a shovel, a pick and a crowbar. We've had 10 years of lottery funding, but unfortunately last year that came to an end. Currently we're looking for long-term funding. We're looking for about £500,000 a year. Presently we have about £150,000 a year, so obviously that has a knock-on effect on how much work you can get done in a year. It's difficult to remember what it was like. I mean, 20, if you go back 25 years um, before the National Trust started doing it um, on a professional basis, the erosion scars in central fells were horrendous. You know, we're talking about erosion on some paths, 10 to 20 metres wide. That is the actual width of the path. Our main aim really is to remove the erosion and create a sustainable path um, for people to walk on. Hopefully it should last hundreds of years. If it doesn't, it means us having to come back and do it again, which is uh, <laughs> it's not an option really.